They're always departing, but they never arrive. And the ones that do arrive, they never well, no one ever gets on, but they're always they're always it's departing, but they never arrive. And the ones that do arrive, they, they never leave. You never see them go. They're always I see they took your suitcase too. They can't get away with this much longer. I'm working up the nerve to go on. Welcome. Welcome to City 17. Dr. Breen again? I was hoping I'd seen the last of him in City 14. I wouldn't say that too loud. This is his base of operations. I so much of City 17 that I elected to establish my administration here. In the citadel so carefully provided our benefits. I've been proud to call City 17 my home. And so? Whether you are here to stay or passing through on your way to parts of the home, welcome to City 17. It's safer here. Welcome. Welcome to City 72. You have chosen or been chosen to relocate to one of our finest remaining urban centers. I thought so much of City 17 that I elected to establish in the citadel so thoughtfully provided by our enemies. And so, whether you are here to stay or this must be a mistake. I got a standard relocation coupon just like everybody else. It's me, Gordon. Barney from Black Mesa. Hey, sorry for the scare. I had to put on a show for the cameras. I've been working undercover with civil protection. I can't take too long or they'll get suspicious. I'm way behind on my beating quota. Yes, Barney, what is it? I'm in the middle of a critical test. Sorry, Doc, but look who's here. Great Scott! Gordon Freeman! I expected more warning. Yeah, you and me both, Doc. He was about to board the express to Nova Prospect. Well, Barney, what do you intend? I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Alex is around here somewhere. She would have a better idea how to get him here. Well, as long as he stays away from checkpoints, we should be okay. Listen, I gotta go, Doc. We're taking enough chances as it is. Very well. And, uh, Gordon, good to see you. Okay, Gordon. You're gonna have to make your own way to Dr. Kleiner's lab. Oh, man! That's what I was afraid of. Get in here, Gordon, before you blow my cover. Pile up some stuff to get through that window and keep going till you're in the plaza. I'll meet up with you later. Thank you. 
in hopes and fears for the future of this people. I also detect some unspoken questions. Do our benefactors really know what's best for us? What gives them the right to make this kind of decision for all mankind? Will they ever deactivate the suppression field and let us breed again? Allow me to address the anxieties underlying your concern rather than try to answer every possible question you might have on voice. First, let us consider the fact that for the first time ever, as a species, immortality is in our reach. This simple fact has far-reaching implications. It requires radical rethinking and revision of our genetic affairs. It also requires planning. Can't take it anymore. Yes. What are we going to do? Attention, residents. Miss Counts detected in your block. Cooperating hey, with your civil protection team. Tell me before right to the wall. Citizen notice. 
Dr. Freeman, I presume. Attention. You better hurry. The Combine can be slow to wake, but once they're up, you don't want to get in their way. Dr. Kleiner said you'd be coming this way. <laughs> I don't think it occurred to him that you might not have a map. I'm sure you don't remember me, though. Man, a few words, aren't you? Remember him from Black Mesa? Your old administrator. <laughs> don't get my dad started on Dr. Breen. Through here. Funny, you showing up on this day in particular. We've been helping people escape the city on foot. It's a dangerous route to my father. 